Hi and welcome to MicroStrategy. My name is Michael Hoffmann and I'm working as a senior sales engineer for MicroStrategy Germany. With this video I want to show you how you can combine every style of business intelligence based on the new MicroStrategy 10.2 platform in order to decrease project cost and implementation efforts significantly. Version 10.2 provides enhancements in the area of agile responsive design dashboards that make it easy to combine these dashboards seamlessly with all the other types of analyses and even transactional processes based on the same platform. Things have changed in the business intelligence space. In our days, nobody wants to reinvent the wheels again and again in order to provide business transparency at your fingertips. In the new space of business intelligence, modular entities like visualizations or even complex analyses can act as reusable objects with interfaces to others, because a user wants to navigate in an ad hoc way between these objects without losing his focus. This approach needs a powerful, unified platform and a semantic layer where every single piece of functionality can be combined seamlessly and even with a centrally managed security. This is the world of MicroStrategy and its unified platform. During the next couple of minutes I will take you on a journey through these capabilities and I will introduce the approach of a management application network to you. Within this network different analyses and styles of BI are wired together in an intelligent way so that these objects can hand over analysis context information and be used with different entry points. Our starting point is an entry portal Pixel Perfect designed and based on a MicroStrategy document. Within this entry portal, graphical links lead the user to different analyses with different styles of BI and even transactional processes. Although this entry portal works Pixel Perfect, it provides a responsive design behavior as well. This works fine in version 10.2 and is based on the new HTML5 framework. Every single diamond stands for a different kind of analysis or a transactional dashboard. The arrows indicate context handover capabilities between these objects without losing the navigation context. All of these objects can work on their own, but some of them can work in relationship to others. Let's have a look at our first Pixel Perfect dashboard. The graphs are not typical Pixel Perfect graphs. These graphs have been developed within seconds in Visual Insight and I reused these objects within minutes as elements from my Pixel Perfect dashboard. With this approach, you are able to design pixel-perfect analyses much faster than ever before. This dashboard is linked to an ad hoc analysis based on the Visual Insight dashboard and with version 10.2 we are able to hand over the current filter selector values from this pixel-perfect dashboard to Visual Insight. This works for multi-value selectors as well and runs in memory extremely fast. The graph matrix with the bubble charts can work as a selector as well. A multi-value selection can be passed over to our Visual Insight dashboard like any other selection context. You can check this behavior in the filter panel of our Visual Insight dashboard. But we can do even more. Visual Insight responsive design dashboards can work with global and local filter selectors. In our newest version 10.2 local selectors can be controlled by this approach as well. In our example, the graph in our Visual Insight dashboard is controlled by a local selector, but not the grid to the right. With these capabilities, individual context handover scenarios can be implemented between pixel-perfect analyses and responsive design agile dashboards based on MicroStrategy Visual Insight. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, reusable analysis objects can work together in a kind of wired business intelligence network or a standalone analysis. With this in mind, it's clear that I can use the regional insight analysis visual insight dashboard on its own as well. You can compare this approach with a kind of service-oriented architecture. Services describe functionality and it's up to the use case to orchestrate these services and their relationships in order to implement complex solutions without losing the control of its entities. And now we want to jump to a different style of BI and we want to look at how these concepts work in this scenario. What we see now is a typical but very easy enterprise report that was implemented pixel perfect and print perfect at the same time. The report is a kind of briefing book with two reports in it and it consists of many pages. Typically this report is distributed to many recipients and often converted into a print perfect PDF file. 
but sometimes the user wants to make a deep dive into the underlying business coherences in order to check critical situations, etc. As you might know, MicroStrategy is the only BI vendor with a unified metadata layer for the whole product architecture that is the basis for the combination of every single style of BI into one unified solution. With this in mind, it's clear that we can use the same concepts you've seen before in the combination of this print-perfect multi-page report with a deep dive ad hoc and self-service dashboard based on Visual Insight. Let's assume you would like to add more data to your ad hoc analysis after you jump from the print-perfect multi-page report to the Agile dashboard without losing your navigation context. That's not a problem. You can connect to any data source, upload your local files, clean your data and join it within minutes without the need of any IT-specific skills. As you can see, the Agile dashboard can work on its own as well. It's not linked in a static way to the Enterprise report. It's a module in our management application network. In the next example, I'll show you a context handover feature between different analyses you might not know and new graphical linking capabilities from version 10.2. Again, we have two linked analyses, a pixel-perfect dashboard and a responsive design visual insight dashboard for further data exploration. We start with the grid to the right. Every single line in this grid refers to a context that is described by its attribute IDs. The profit column works as a selector that is able to pass the compound attribute context from its line to an external analysis. MicroStrategy can hand over a data context between different analyses by using selectors and prompts. What might be new for you is the fact that you can combine both of them and you can even configure the prompts in that way that they run in memory against a huge MicroStrategy Prime in memory cube that offers the widest range of flexibility and can boost almost any kind of application. What you see right now is the new graphical linking capability from version 10.2. Graphical elements can hand over their context to other analyses like Visual Insight, Dashboards, etc. This approach can be combined with all the other possibilities like using multi-value selectors or multiple prompts at the same time. I think you know what comes next. My Visual Insight dashboard can work on its own and it's not statically linked to the Pixel Perfect Performance Overview dashboard you've seen before. This is another example of the modularity of this application. When we go on with the presentation, you will see that even agile, responsive design Visual Insight dashboards can work as a starting point for a dynamic context handover mechanism. The next example is more advanced and combines features that are not typically part of an enterprise business intelligence platform. As I mentioned before, MicroStrategy has an extreme wide range of functionality and everything is based on the same metadata with the same central security on top of the same unified platform. With that said, I want to jump into a specific phase of a planning process that I implemented without coding based on MicroStrategy transaction services on top of the same unified platform. In this planning phase, the user is able to check and adjust planning items as needed. If a critical risk has to be described, additional edit controls appear and request the user to describe the situation. The beauty of this approach is that this pixel-perfect transaction-enabled dashboard is linked to an agile ad hoc analysis where the user is able to get a maximum of transparency over all planning processes in real time. In this example, I entered the ad hoc analysis dashboard without a dynamic context, but this would be possible as well as you've seen before in several examples. This demo shows how far we can go with these capabilities. Even transaction-enabled solution components can be part of this management application network. The navigation between all of them can be designed in a seamless way and every single application module or analysis can be started without or with a dynamic user context that describes the user focus at runtime. The implementation challenge of a management application network is a description and implementation of modular entities like single dashboards, reports or transaction-enabled components. You need to have a deep knowledge about the requirements and use cases from a business perspective in order to slice these modular entities to the right size and to make them elastic. You've done something right if a single module can be entered from different navigation perspectives.
And now it's time for our last example. In this example, I won't use pixel perfect solution components and I want to focus on agile, responsive design, visual insight, dashboard, intercommunication only. We start with a freestyle impact analysis dashboard. In this dashboard, you see some grids at the top and each grid has an attribute and one metric. The grids are sorted. If a user selects an item or several items in these grids, all the other coherences to the other grids are updated so that you will never get a dead end of navigation. By the way, the user would be able to replace these metrics within seconds with just a mouse click if she wants to change her perspective. This is a kind of freestyle, in-memory analysis. In the bottom right corner of this dashboard you see dynamic links that lead to a more detailed ad hoc analysis dashboard. Please remember, we are not in the pixel perfect world of MicroStrategy at this moment. The more detailed dashboard works as an agile, responsive design, visual insight dashboard as well. So what you saw is a context handshake between two different Agile dashboards. The links that hand over the user focus from the first to the second dashboard are established by using HTML linking capabilities. Since version 10 Visual Insight is based on HTML5 only and this means that you can even enhance this approach if you like. You could use images for example as links for the data handshake between different analyses. This works in the combination with pixel perfect dashboards or reports as well. Please have a look at the graphic capabilities of this dashboard. What you see here is one single graph matrix that consists of two different graphs and each graph has dual access with trend line and forecast visualizations. As I mentioned at the beginning of this presentation, you are able to use these kinds of graphs now very easily in pixel perfect dashboards as well. In combination with a very strong new capability of version 10.2, this leads to a very flexible approach. With version 10.2, it's possible to exchange the data context for the whole dashboard or individual visualizations within seconds based on robust metadata or spontaneously uploaded data that can come from almost any data source. And you don't need any IT specific skills in order to do this. At the end of this video I want to do a little workshop with you. I want to show you how easy it is to use graphical visual insight capabilities within pixel perfect dashboards. As you know both concepts are different and our customers need both. This depends on specific business use cases. As you might know visual insight works in a responsive way and adjusts all its visualizations to the user's device or the window size of the browser dynamically. Pixel Perfect dashboard does not have these capabilities and that's good because it has to work pixel perfect. But it provides a kind of responsive effect as well. MicroStrategy can zoom the whole dashboard dynamically in order to fit best to the screen of the user's device. In our example I used a Visual Insight dashboard with one visualization and converted this dashboard to a pixel perfect document with just a mouse click. Then I cleared the document from the not needed components in seconds. In Visual Insight I used a color palette and the graph is linked to this color palette. This behavior is still active after the conversion to my pixel perfect document. With a pixel perfect document we can implement two kinds of solutions. Pixel perfect multi-page enterprise reports or pixel perfect dashboards and I want to focus on the dashboard in my example. In the meantime I added a graphical background that I developed with Photoshop before. Pixel Perfect means that you can adjust almost everything to your corporate design and you can even use graphical overlays or transparency effects in order to create beautiful solutions. But as always, a lot more formatting capabilities leads to a higher effort in the implementation of these components. In a Visual Insight dashboard, you are not able to adjust the location, width and height of visualizations pixel precise and this is good because you want a dynamic optimization of the dashboard in a responsive way in order to save configuration effort. But in the world of Pixel Perfect, you can use all these capabilities and in combination with visualizations that you've developed within minutes based on Visual Insight before. Our Pixel Perfect dashboard looks good so far, but now we want to integrate another visualization that comes from a different Visual Insight dashboard. The process for the integration is easy. In the first step, we convert our Visual Insight dashboard with a second visualization into a Pixel Perfect document as well. Then we link this document temporarily to our master document by using the document layout feature. 
After that, it's just copy and paste in order to integrate the visualization into our new good-looking dashboard. We can delete the additional layout after copying the second visualization into the clipboard of our operating system. Please let me wrap up the things you've seen so far while the video shows my last implementation steps for the integration of the second visualization into the Pixel Perfect dashboard. Let's be honest. It's all about speed, cost and flexibility in the implementation of demanding applications that can make our customers and users feel enthusiastic about their solutions. In our days, we don't want to spend the time and money to develop huge, monolithic applications anymore that are very expensive to maintain and can't be enhanced easily. Therefore, we need a new approach that provides us the capabilities to develop smart, loosely coupled BI components that can be reused and linked to each other dynamically. The basis for this approach is a unified, metadata-driven platform combined with a centrally security mechanism that works hand-in-hand -hand with any kind of solution components. MicroStrategy is the only business intelligence vendor in the market that provides this unified platform for all these different styles of BI. And as you've seen in this video, you are able to combine all this and even transactional processes easily. I hope you enjoyed this little video. As a senior sales engineer at MicroStrategy Germany, I need to use and implement these capabilities every month during POCs or customer projects. In most of these engagements, I got the feedback from our customers and prospects that these capabilities are key for the development of elastic, flexible business intelligence solutions that can grow smoothly over time. With version 10.2, Visual Insight and its visualizations can be integrated in these elastic business intelligence solutions more efficiently than ever before. I want to encourage every customer and prospect to try this approach because it helps significantly to decrease project cost on the one hand and to manage project complexity on the other hand more easily. If you are interested in more of my MicroStrategy 10 videos, you can find more video links in the description of this video on YouTube. Thanks a lot for your attention. I wish you all the best. Bye!